Hi there, today we're gonna have a look at guitar octave tones. When approaching guitar octave tones, you should start slow. So in order to hear it well, okay, you should start like... Other than just... Okay, it sounds good, but when you start soloing an octave, it should sound like... Uh, you hear the octave, this is just uh, the melody, okay, so... So, in other words, you just leave more space, right, you know, just have, you know, more whole notes or half notes, especially, you know, what type of tempo you're playing. Just leave the note. So you hear, you hear the fading out of the note, and you hear the octave, the, the effect. I usually use less drive in the usual, especially in the recording. Because if you use too much drive, it's getting too nosy, too much to hear in the mix, okay? If you, especially if you're a hard, you know, picture. Last but not least, uh, you should focus on the tone, okay? Especially uh, on the harmonies, okay? Just don't, you know, depend on only on pentatonics. Here's a blue note. Or you some something from the minor, you know, scales, okay? Let's. I'm gonna use only the pentatonic now. But if you use uh, some blue notes, okay? You, you hear it, it's going somewhere else. Or if you use some minor. I use also some chromatic, you know, steps. So, firstly, start slow, okay? When you're soloing with octave pedals, okay, start slow. Secondly, use less drive, all right? And lastly, focus on the tone, because the tone is uh, what is unique, you know, and in your playing. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next video.